Okay, so on the rope dart tech group, there's been a lot of talk about cradle and cradle play. Um, quite simply, breaking it down nice and simplistic, that's a cradle. Simply going from your guide hand and back across to your anchor, that's creating a cradle. Um, it's really just creating that loop and a back point. First person that I know of that really started playing with cradle play was Rachel Blue. And her style involves a lot of points there. That's cradle. That's the cradle. It's just creating a solid point between your guide hand and your anchor hand to manipulate the dart. Some stuff that I've been doing out, out of the cradle and usually do is here, 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 there, there, Tangled mess. Dragonfly. New rope, so shit happens. But let's do that again. Can double up the anchor. So it's a double cradle. Primarily, the cradle is just there to take up slack and give the whole, oh, he's got a smaller prop. What the hell, it's all of a sudden huge. stuff that you can use the cradle to catch the dart. It's nice, simple, adds a little bit of flair to your style. And it's nice and fun. Glad you guys are starting to get into cradle play. Keep it up.